Well, welcome to uh, our online service for Sunday the 24th of May. I have to say it still feels very strange uh, saying this, talking as I do every weekend into a camera, always hoping that there are people watching uh, these video podcasts. Yet I, I know that there are, as some of you have taken time by email, by text, uh, by sending cards or even phoning, to make contact uh, with me to say that you are uh, appreciating these services each week. Uh, as well as our High Street members here in Lurgan, I know that there are many others from other churches in the area, such as uh, our sister congregation in Lurgan Queen Street, uh, Cranagill and Tully, Tully Rowan societies uh, who link in uh, with us uh, each week. Maybe there will be those who are watching who have no church connection at all. But whoever you are, I just want to say to all of you, uh, you are all truly welcome. Well, you will know that this week we have seen the first steps in the easing of the lockdown restrictions. And it seems, though, that it will be many months before uh, churches are able to be open for services. And even then, it will still most likely to be under strict social distancing restrictions. I'm sure that we are all glad that we're, we're beginning uh, to see small rays of hope as we look into the future. This week we will be having a meeting of the Church Council over Zoom uh, to give opportunity to review how we are all coping with this lockdown season. And also just to begin to, to look at, at what the church uh, might look like when we do get the go ahead to return. One thing I can say is that it has been really encouraging uh, to see members engaging with our, our home groups, uh, uh, prayer meetings and, and, and fellowship bands over Zoom uh, in recent weeks. I have to say too that we do have a particular concern about how we might better link uh, with our parents and children, especially with our youth pastor, Mark, uh, currently on furlough. Today is Aldersgate Sunday. It's the time of the year when Methodists all over the world are remembering May 24th, 1738. And this was a day when John Wesley, the founder of our Methodist Church, uh, had an encounter with God that is described by many as uh, the conversion of John Wesley that marked the, the beginning of uh, a great spiritual awakening in his own life, but also a great spiritual awakening that happened in the 18th century across our land, a, a revival that, that birthed our Methodist Church our opening uh, hymn this morning uh, was written by uh, John Wesley's brother, Charles. He was a great hymn writer and also co-worker in this revival. And it is the familiar words of love divine, all loves excelling. Let us worship God as we sing this song together. <laughs> 